Good evening, WWE Universe, and welcome to a very special edition of WWE Slam as we celebrate the 13th anniversary of ECW One Night Stand. You join us here this evening at the Hammerstein Ballroom in the heart of good old New York. Of course, I wouldn't be alone for this very special evening as joining me tonight is none other than Byron Saxon, Michael Cole and the extremely delightful Corey Graves. Over the last few weeks, the women of WWE Slam have been competing in a tag team tournament to crown the first ever Slam Tag Team Champions. And what better way to do that than right here tonight in a tag team ladder match in celebration of ECW. The very first ECW One Night Stand pay-per-view special produced by the talented Tommy Dreamer took place 13 years ago to the day and went on to be one of the very first of many ECW One Night Stand specials. The series of events featured ECW legends such as Sabu, the Dudley Boys, the Sandman, Rob Van Dam and many, many more. The male superstars of ECW left their mark on not only ECW, but the professional wrestling industry as a whole. However, tonight we're here to celebrate the women of ECW and what they did to put ECW on the map. Women like Lita, Jazz, Bueller, Luna Vachon, Francine, Kimona, Sunny, Extreme, Expose, and so, so many more. Because behind every man, is an even stronger woman. So join us here this evening in New York as we celebrate ECW and crown the brand new Slam Women's Tag Team Champions. this six-man tag team match is for you. You can say that again. We're looking at six of WWE's most exciting superstars all in one match. It doesn't get much more exciting than that. Tag team action coming up next, guys. And both these teams come into this match incredibly confident. 
But unfortunately for one of them, they're going to have their confidence crushed by the end of this one. No one's backing down here. What an impasse. She needs to make sure she doesn't end up in the wrong part of town, if you know what I mean. How do you prevent something like that from happening? No matter what the odds are or what type of match we're talking about, it's all awesome to me. Three on three, why not? Have at it. Talk about devastation. A quick finish. Can she do it? And Carmella avoids the early pin. Just not enough damage done yet, Cole. Carmella may be in a bad way here. She's got two very capable partners in her corner. Now might be a good time to bring one of them in. Hey, when you put six of the most competitive women on the roster today in the same ring at the same time, somebody's going to get hurt. And it just so happens to be her. She certainly hasn't looked impressive here tonight, guys, but it's still early and things can turn around on a dime here in WWE. any indication she's not taking any prisoners in this one the single leg Boston Crab calling an audible now why she had it right where he wanted her teamwork at its best Bella is on the attack. She clearly liked the results from the first time she delivered that move. If Carmella hits, this one's over. Adams appearing uneasy here. And a confidence she came into this six women's tag team match. Look out, there's the tag. And that changes the entire outlook for these women, Michael. Just toying with the competition a little. Look at this power, she's just so dominant. Drop kick. Keep your eye on this one. She's calling her out. 
I think she should stay down. With a crushing missile drop kick. Little misstep. She's got the shoulders down. The end may be near. I see where she's going with this. Oh, she wants this win bad. Carmella wants everyone to know that she's in charge. Looks like Lane's energy level is starting to fade. She really needs to think about making a tag, guys. This woman has absolutely no quit in her, guys. Taking on a little offense like this isn't going to end her night. I can assure you of that. Look at her go. She goes to the schoolboy. signs of life. She's showing a lot more than that. Amazing elevation on that drop kick. Desperately needs to... There it is. She's made the tag. And her partner is on absolute fire right now. Morgan with a reason to be concerned. She's got two partners in her corner itching to get in there, guys. This isn't your traditional tag team match, guys. These matches require a slightly altered game plan. Nope. Reverses it. Adams beginning to breathe a little heavy now. She really needs to think about making a tag, guys. Given what she's been through in this match, she may very well be the weak with such authority. Got all of that one, that's for sure. Did you see the impact on that? Wow. Ref's checking on this headlock. Back and forth we go. No, she breaks it. Wow, she's quite the escape artist, Michael. That one was off the mark. Awful. Just plain awful. She's going for the cover. She got her with the drop kick. Takes her down. Wow. Nice move right there. Beautiful head scissors. And she's toying with her now. She's in control. Comes up big with the reversal. And she turns it around on her. Her unbelievable act. And this has got to be it. Oh, going to the top. High risk. Hoping to make a tag here. It sounds like... Oh, and she makes the tag. And not a moment too soon, Michael. Corey, tell me, just how much strength is carrying your opponent around like this take? Let's put it this way, Cole. Saxton would never be able to do it. That shot landed on her and was a direct hit. Concentrating on the body here. She just will not let up. Going for it all here. There it is, the K2. Can't waste any time here. Looking at it here.
struggling to get up right here. Tough spot to be in at this point, Michael. She's looking at it. Fighting to get a huge slam right there. That has got to be it. That just echoed throughout this entire arena. Oh, and she has an answer for that one. Lanza in some big trouble here. This could spell the beginning to the end for her here in this six-man tag team match. You know, when you step into the ring opposite three of the most dominant women on the roster today, things like this are bound to happen. Her opponent has been absolutely ruthless all night long. It's as if she refuses to lose here, guys. Ill-advised move. She goes down hard. She's going to be feeling that one for a while. Will this be it? Both teams working well here together. That's not always the case in a six-man tag team match. Oftentimes, you'll see personal agendas eat their way into the action. This should do it right there. How did you not see that? You're a licensed WWE referee. Oh, and she's dropped there. Yeah, she might be done here, guys. Carmella with a nice reversal. She's on the attack and on the move. Takes her off her feet. That's how you eliminate somebody's vertical game. What a shot! If you take many more like that, you're gonna resemble a heavy bag. Carmella, ouch! Bronco Buster! That's all she wrote. It could be over here. Wow, the ref got hit hard there. He may not get back up, Cole. Having a tough time getting back up here. As you would expect, given what she's been through here tonight. She's down, and she may be out. I think you're right, Michael. I mean, she's not even moving. counter now there's the counter drops her with authority wow that was intense a move like that is completely unnecessary unless you want to degrade your opposition of course look at her here she's just reveling the opportunity to make a mockery of her opponent and she's driven to the mat hard. Uh-oh, the face lift. This one is over. Shoulders down, this could be it. What a six-man tag match. up a major win right there that is what i like to call a statement win michael wow just wow i'm speechless what an amazing match please welcome my guest at this time alicia fox alicia the iconic costume your shot the summer's championship this past weekend how do you deal with something like that?
For weeks now, the Iconics have not only put you down physically, but it seems they don't have an issue with targeting your mental state. Care to comment? Thanks for joining me, Alicia. A great start to our ECW special already this evening as seen moments ago when the infamous Extreme Expose made their return to ECW, silencing Sam's very own blonde bombshells. I don't know about you, but I for one love seeing Kelly Kelly, Layla and Brooke back in a WWE ring and the night is far from over. Later this evening in our main event of the evening, Nia Jax and Karma go toe to toe in a steel cage match to finally answer who is the most dominant woman. Who will leave the four sides of steel with their bragging rights? Find out later this evening. Also later tonight, we crown our very first Slam Women's Tag Team Champions as Team BAD take on Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair in a Tag Team Championship ladder match. Who will walk out holding the gold? Stay tuned to WWE Slam. Louisiana, the Phenom Jack. 
Two of WWE's top stars ready to go here in one-on-one -on -one action. This is the match I've been waiting for, guys, ever since it was announced. I've been looking forward to seeing these two clash. And guys, these women appear to be in peak physical condition for this one. Well, they'd better be cold. Given how hot the women's division is right now, even if you're slightly off your game, you're gonna get picked off in an instant. And there's the bell. And here we go. This is the type of battle that you can show someone who's new to our brand of entertainment and say, this is what WWE's all about. I don't know who's looking more forward to this, the women in the ring or me. As we get started here, I wouldn't mind if we got through this match without having to hear you two bicker. Okay, guys. I wanted to talk a little bit about Lita here. For those that haven't seen her, tell us what she has to do to win this one. She's certainly a force, Cole, but you have to remember who she's in the ring with there, too. Neither of these girls are pushovers, that's for sure. I do expect her to show her opponent and the rest of the WWE that she's going to be someone to reckon with for a long... Looking for the quick 10, and she gets her shoulder up. Yeah, this is way too early to be going for the win. Look at Lita here. An early pin attempt. She's got a long way to go before she should be thinking about a pinfall victory here. She saw the opening and got the shoulder up. He's putting it all on the line here. Just a hellacious power slam. She practically broke her back there. And a great shot by Lita. Look at Lita here. Jack starting to stall a bit here. Here's what we're going to see what she's made of. And you just get that feeling that being outside the ring so much here in this match will eventually come back to haunt her. Hey, we all know how aggressive she can be inside that ring, and you never know what she might do to get back control of this match. Two. Three. Four. From what we've seen and heard tonight, there must be serious injuries. Six. She counters with a move of her own. Okay, now she's just showing off. Back in the ring now. Going with a suplex, belly to back. Lita looking to get to the top rope. Look out! Her athleticism and leaping ability are off the charts. Hoping to end it early. One, two. This is it. The twist of fate. There it is. Lita is really applying pressure now, guys. Lita has a... Oh, what a moonsault. She's got a chance to win it here. A move like that is completely unnecessary, unless you want to degrade your opposition, of course. She's going to have all sorts of trouble. A quick finish! Can she do it?
Guys, when you have as trained an eye as I do, you get to a point where you can see the finisher coming before it actually comes. And let me tip you off to something here. It's coming, and it's coming very soon. She's wasting no time taking over this contest. Lita's not going to like this. Not even close. Jeez, that was embarrassing. Six. Seven. Ah, close to getting a count out here. Nah, this is just some strategic gamesmanship. Can she do it here? She's calling her out. She might have it. She comes up with a slam. She can pick up the win here, guys. Look at Lita here. She's ended many a match with that move. Yeah, let's get another look at that. They should do it right there. Keep your eye on this one. Having a tough time getting back up here. As you would expect, given what she's been through here tonight. She's tough, but nobody's that tough. Look at this! So fast. Look at her go. She's looking at it. Perfectly timed slam. And she looked like she had no chance. This could do it. There's the pin. It's over. It's all over. Here is your winner, the Phenom, Jack. Talk about having to dig down deep to pick up the win. That's a big win right there. Anytime you can pin another WWE competitor's shoulders to the mat for the three count, you should be proud. We barely started here this evening, and so much has already happened with the surprise appearances from Extreme Expose, Lita, and Jazz. Who else will make their return to ECW right here tonight? Stay tuned to find out. Still to come here this evening, Sasha Banks and Naomi go head to head with Charlotte Flair and Becky Lynch for the Slam Women's Tag Team Championship in a championship ladder match. Will Sasha finally claim gold here in WWE Slam or will Charlotte Flair and Becky Lynch become the new Tag Team Champions? However, up next Raquel Diaz takes to the ring for another edition of the Raquel Diaz Open Invitational. Making her way to the ring from El Paso, Texas, the WWE Women's Champion, Rachel Diaz. 
Big time singles matches on deck here, and Byron, what should we expect to see here tonight? Well, given the shape these superstars appear to be in here tonight, I fully expect to see one of the most competitive matches we've seen in a very long time. Byron, I think these women may be caught off guard a bit by this stellar crowd reaction they're receiving here. I don't know why, Michael. It seems like they get one of the biggest reactions each and every week. you think they'd be used to it by now. Here we go, gentlemen. Huge title match coming up and a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now. Well, she certainly has her work cut out for her. And Byron, tell me, what do you think of her chances here tonight? Well, given how dominant the champs looked as of late, I have to say that I'm not wild about her chances here tonight. But hey, crazier things have happened. Of course, the title is on the line in this one, guys. And don't be surprised if history is made. Introducing the challenger from Melbourne, Australia, Emma! Introducing the champion from El Paso, Texas. She is the WWE Women's Champion, Rachel Diaz. Plant your butts in those seats and get ready. Whoa, and a bit of a test of strength here. Here we go with Emma, working for control. In full control. Controlling the head. Squeezing down on the head. And here's Emma. How about we touch on Diaz a bit? How can she make sure she defends her crown here? This is the time to shine, Michael. So much on the line here. Some people can only dream of being in this position. 
Right about now, she's wondering if being a champion is all it's cracked up to be. Tough matchup. Oh, and she attacks the jaw. Neutralizes her with a neck breaker. Didn't see that takedown coming. Emma with good timing here. Well, that was impressive. Looks like Diaz starting to slip a bit. She's not going to let her title slip away that easily, though. Her talents inside the ring certainly are commendable, guys. The way she treats people, however, is a completely different story. And there's a vicious slam. And there's the neck breaker. Good luck turning your head after that one. A quick finish. Can she do it? She's staying in this match. Yeah, seemed to be just testing the waters a bit there. Whoa, that was some reversal by Emma. Wow, is there nothing she can't do? A slick reversal. She's got the skill to go on runs. Now we'll see if she has the stamina. Well, I guess that'll teach her a lesson. she's trying to prove a point here. Emma powers that shoulder up. Clearly not enough damage done. Uh-oh. Here we go. Here we go. With such authority. So impressive. Having a tough time getting back up here. As you would have Look at this. Nope, that one misses. Boy, that was terrible. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Here she goes again. She turns it around on her. She just will not let up. Emma's on the attack. Emma with the offense. Six. Got the reversal. Moves like that can upset your opponent more than hurt them. She's going for the cover. That was some reversal by Emma. No, there's the reversal. Emma with good timing here. Emma looking to deliver them. Here we go for the win. Oh. 
the champ being put to the test in a major way. We might be witnessing the final moments of her championship reign. She's in tough shape here, guys, which is a little surprising considering she's been able to execute not one, but two finishers so far here tonight. As we all know, she's not necessarily the most respectful competitor on the roster, which means she's liable to do just about anything to get the upper hand. Big reversal for her there. She's got the shoulders down. We've seen this before. She certainly landed that one. There's no way the champ can lose now. She's going for the cover. One, two. She's off on that one, Corey. You can say that again. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Two. Look at her go. It could be over here. Emma with a slick reversal. Almost knocked silly by that strike. She comes up big with the reversal. Great offense by Emma. I wouldn't be at all surprised if she doesn't get up here, guys. Yeah, this might just be the end of the line for her. Emma looking to deliver the... And this has got to be it. Connects with a counter. one coming. Hits her with a clothesline from seemingly out of nowhere. Corey, she's not getting up. Well, she better if she wants to win this match. Look out! And that one takes her down. Turn out the lights, Cole. This one's over. Emma with the offense. She's taking a while to get up here. I was just thinking the same thing, Michael. Look at this! Oh man, she's rolling now. Oh, you can't take many more shots to the face like that. And now it's Emma with momentum again. She got her with a reversal. A stretch that would make Stu Hart blush. She's got her where she wants her. Running out of time here. Oh, come on, get in there. Bringing it back into the ring. Incoming. She looks for it once again. Gory bomb getting ugly here. Now it's time to capitalize. One, two. And she delivers a crushing leg drop. Shoulders down. This could be it. And she comes up with a big counter. Not today. Here's the pin. Title on the line. There may be no coming back from this incredible beatdown. This could do it. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. And the knee delivers. And she's driven down hard. This might just be the end of the road for her. 
Emma was just one step behind there, guys. What athleticism. Oh, she's not getting up. Just pin her. This match is over. Whoa! This should do it right there. She's got the skill to go on runs. Now we'll see if she has the stamina. She clearly liked the results from the first time she delivered that move. Uh -oh. oh, man. Emma Sandwich. Emma needs to put her away here, Cole. Emma is quickly into the cover with a title on the line. She's got something in mind. She's turning the tables. They ain't turned yet. Still got some work to do. And now she's on the offensive. This is a grueling championship match. Nobody wants to lose this opportunity. What a title defense. here we're looking at complete domination here again with it she's showing no mercy tonight looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring This might be it. Gory bomb. Gory bomb. Emma is in a very bad spot here. Oh, man. Emma doesn't even know where she is. Shocking things just moments ago as it was Emma who answered Raquel Diaz's open invitational challenge for the Slam Women's Championship. With Raquel only managing to retain the championship by the skin of her team, what does this mean for Los Guerrero Familia? Has the once powerful faction finally come to an end? We can only speculate. Still to come in our ECW special of WWE Slam, Nia Jax and Karma clash inside four sides of steel after the two Goliaths have fought back and forth in recent weeks. Who will come out and top in our main event of the evening? Stay tuned to WWE Slam. However, up next, the Tag Team Championship Tournament comes to a close as Team BAD collide with Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair in a Tag Team Championship ladder match. With so much on the line for all of these athletes, which team will leave New York as the Tag Team Champions? That match, people, is up next.
Guys, we have incredibly high stakes here tonight in this ladder match. And it's because of those stakes that I suspect these superstars will do just about anything to be the first one to climb the ladder and grab the gold. seconds away from kicking off one of the most exciting matches in all of WWE, the ladder match. And tonight, the championship hangs high above the ring as these superstars will likely use every resource available to them to ensure they're the first one up that ladder. Naomi is ready to roll. You know, I can't remember the last time I was this excited for a championship match. How about it? How is she going to win this tough matchup? I've been in the same position before, so I know exactly what's going on inside that head. It's intense, nerve-wracking, and exciting all at once. I do expect her to show her opponent and the rest of the WWE that she's going to be someone to reckon with for a long time to come. I think Sasha Banks is done playing. Now we have Naomi on the attack. Sasha Banks is making her presence known. Now we have Naomi on the attack. She lands the boot. Legs taken out by the Russian leg sweep. Becky Lynch may be in trouble here. It's the fear of the unknown that can sometimes hinder a woman in a tornado tag team match such as this. Well, she certainly seems to favor being outside the ring. Though for the life of me, I cannot figure out why. Well, she's looked good up until now. She just has to make sure not to absorb too much punishment here if she wants to get back into this thing. Oh, and sent crashing back down. Naomi being overwhelmed here. And Naomi manages to reverse out of that one. Oh, no! And there's the reversal from Sasha Banks. Got the reversal. Oh, the reversal by Becky Lynch. Becky Lynch with the offense. Becky Lynch with the offense. The elbow drop lands. Tough situation to be in right here. Yeah, you have to think this is not going to end well. Sasha Banks is making her presence known. Good luck stopping Naomi when she's rolling like this. Charlotte with a nice reversal. Oh, yeah, here's Charlotte. Exploder suplex. What's going to happen now? She needs to find a way to get to her feet. Time is of the essence here, too, Michael. Oh, man, she's rolling now. She's countering nicely now. Yeah, a second ago, she was almost done. We'll see how long she can keep it up. And there's the stunner. This thing might be over real soon. 
Oh, the reversal by Becky Lynch. And she hits the drop kick. Oh, no. What's going to happen to her pretty face? This is going too far now. Check her out. Back in the ring now. She hits her with the boot. Oh, yeah, here's Charlotte. Corey, she's not getting up. Well, she better if she wants to win this match. That's worth another look. Yeah, I want to see that again. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. The boss is giving some serious orders right now. This could be it. Bankrupt. There it is. Charlotte is in trouble. She delivers a lethal forearm. And a powerful forearm. Almost knocked silly by that strike. She delivers a lethal forearm. I think she's trying to prove a point here. She, uh, all right. That one misses big time. Better luck next time. And Naomi manages to reverse out of that one. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Oh, what a backbreaker. Man, just ugly impact. Charlotte is in trouble. Charlotte is in trouble. What a great win in such a unique style matchup. Ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. Charlotte Flair and Becky Lynch are the first ever Slam Tag Team Champions. Commiserations to both Sasha Banks and Naomi, who have put on a series of great matches over the last few weeks. Still to come later this evening, Alicia Fox looks set to take revenge on the Iconics after recent weeks. With Alicia promising a surprise partner, who will answer the call? And will Alicia Fox finally silence the Iconics? However, up next, we hear from Slam Interim General Manager Vicky Guerrero as she takes to the microphone to discuss tonight's actions.
making her way to the ring from Scottsdale, Arizona, Nikki Bella. Ladies and gentlemen, we're looking at one of the greatest women's competitors of our time, Nikki Bella. And tonight's just another night to add to her already impressive legacy. Yeah, and for me, tonight will go a long way in determining exactly which woman is the most dominant in WWE. Same here, Michael. I'd say it's almost impossible to overstate the importance of this match, especially as it relates to where in the pecking... From Jersey City, New Jersey, Don Marie. This is great, guys. This battle royal promises to be amazing. And let's not forget that simply going over the top rope is not enough to get eliminated. Both feet must touch the arena floor in order for your night to end. Byron, what do you think about the shape these women appear to be in right now? They've clearly been prepping for this one. Oh, without a doubt, Michael. I don't know specifically what they're doing inside the gym. From New York, Stephanie. Plenty of drama surrounding this battle royal here tonight. And with so many top names competing in this battle royal, there's no telling who will walk away as the last superstar standing. And Corey, we should point out just how focused she appears to be here tonight. That's one of the things I like best about her, Cole. No matter who she's in the ring with, she's always laser focused on the task at hand. From Delaware, the Queen, Francine. A big time battle royal here, guys. Who do you like in this one, Byron? Well, historically, you're safest when you put your money on the biggest superstar. But to be honest, I'm not sure. I can see any one of these competitors walking away with a win. And I'd say these women definitely look ready to get this one started. So am I, Michael. I don't think I've ever seen these women give a poor performance. And I'm willing to bet tonight will be no different. From Los Angeles, California, Shirley Martinez. If this one lives up to the hype, Byron, we're in for an amazing match here tonight. There's no reason to think this one won't live up to the hype, Michael. We're looking at some of the most intense competitors in all of WWE. I don't know who's more excited to get this one going, these women or this crowd. Or Saxton. Jeez, would you relax already? I know this is a big match, but you need to be bouncing up and down like that. Come on, it's creepy.
from New Orleans, Louisiana, Taryn Terror. As we get started here, let me remind everybody that the only way to get eliminated from this battle royal is to get thrown over the top rope and have both feet touch the arena floor. And not only does it take a tremendous amount of skill to be successful in a battle royal, but there's also a good deal of luck that goes into it as well. Byron, I think these women may be caught off guard a bit by this stellar crowd reaction they're receiving here. I don't know why, Michael. It seems like they get one of the biggest reactions each and every week. you think they'd be used to it by now. From Pennsylvania, Rose Mercedes. A massive humanity in the ring right now as we get ready for this battle royal. And this is going to be one of those matches where you hope the crew did everything in their power to construct a ring as durably as possible. Otherwise, we might be in for a disaster. And what about this crowd reaction, guys? Yeah, the WWE Universe is definitely ready to see these women square off. And I can't say that I blame them. and Brie Bella making her way to the ring tonight. Actually, that's Nikki, Michael. Oh, wait, never mind. Yep, yep, that's Brie. Man, they are difficult to tell apart. And guys, these women appear to be in peak physical condition for this one. Well, they'd better be cold. Given how hot the women's division is right now, even if you're slightly off your game, you're going to get picked off in an instant. This is it, guys. We're ready to get this match going. Well, you can't ask for much more than this, especially given how talented these women are. And it sounds like the sold-out arena is about to come unglued for this one. And the knee gets her good. Look at her here. She's just reveling the opportunity to make a mockery of her opponent. Nikki just a force in that ring. Boy, do I just love this. Let's take a moment to talk about Marie. What can our newer viewers expect from this woman? When you're an entrant in a battle royal like this, she must be able to keep her eyes on everyone else at the same time. It's really a requirement if you want to have a chance at victory and battle royal supremacy. Good grief, she needs to watch her step. And she delivers a punishing atomic drop. Getting in with a strike like that lets you know just what kind of fight you're in. Well, that rocked her all right. God, what a stiff shot. And right on the mark. She's starting to sweat a bit. Here's what we're going to see what she's made of. Oh. 
Mercedes looks stymied. She doesn't appear too concerned, however. Guys, this is where all that self-respect she has pays off. Sure, she's taking on some offense, but she's confident enough in her game to bounce back. And she delivers a lightning quick strike. With a move like that, she's just trying to insult her opponent. Swing and a miss. That was strike one, two, and three. Nope, that one misses. Boy, that was terrible. Nicely done. Dodges a bullet there. That misses the mark. That wasn't even close, Michael. Big reversal for her there. And she turns it around on her. She is on fire. Had that one well scouted. I think she's trying to prove a point here. Brie Bella's on the attack now. She's a live wire when she's plugged in. Oh, the reversal by Brie Bella. Oh, man, she's rolling now. That might have hurt her ego more than anything else. Nobody home for that one. No kidding. There weren't even any lights on. What a forearm smash. She is just so dominant. Look at her go. And now she's on the offensive. And she lands a perfectly executed drop kick. Wow. Missed by a mile. Had that one well scouted. Hits with the clothesline. She is on fire. Momentum not on Nikki Bella's side. We've certainly seen her withstand worse in the past, though. Her opponent's finally showing signs of life here. For a moment there, I thought she was going to cruise to victory. Mercedes in a potentially bad spot right here. You have to wonder how much more she has left in the tank. Oh, man. Brie Bella. Taking a page out of the Daniel Bryan playbook. She'll leave a mark permanently. She has got to take advantage here. She counters with a move of her own. Nothing pretty about that elbow. That's like watching someone being manhandled. What force? She's not playing any games tonight. Everyone better watch out. Even me. She delivers a lethal forearm. Corey, let's look at this again. She's in control now. That's not what she had planned. Well, if it was, she better rethink her plans. A few inches off there. Inches? She missed by at least a foot, Cole. She's in a bad way here. Bottom line, she's got to get up. She can't win this match on her back. She seems intent on injuring that back. That is a beautiful thing to watch. Firmly in the driver's seat after that slam. Corey, tell me, just how much strength is carrying your opponent around like this take? Let's put it this way, Cole. Saxton would never be able to do it. Nikki's in trouble. Oh, and she gets floored by that one. Yeah, there's no staying on your feet after something like that. We're looking at complete domination here. Pays for that one. Talk about a target. The largest bullseye is always in someone's back. That strike was strategically placed on her opponent. She's a live wire when she's plugged in. And she comes up with a big counter. What a brutal way to take someone off their feet. You gotta be kidding me. Got her good with a chop. Nope, reverses it. This capacity crowd starting to sense the end is near and I don't disagree. She might just have nothing left to give at this point. Sometimes when you land your finisher and it doesn't actually finish the match, you're taken out of your game. And I think that's exactly what happened with her here tonight. Hey, she oftentimes fights like she's got nothing to lose, which means she may very well throw all caution to the wind here in an attempt to get back into this thing.
Things have really taken a turn for the worse for Nikki Bella. This may very well be the beginning of the end for her. If she ends up losing this match, it won't be from a lack of trying. I mean, how many finishers did she go for tonight? Unreal. The way I see it, this might be a good time for the finisher. Nikki Bella with nice contact there. A clubbing clothesline. Taken down with a beautiful suplex. See what kind of response we'll get. Byron, can she even get back to her feet? More importantly, does she even know where she is right now? And there's the counter. Now Nikki Bella is controlling the tempo of this match. Now we have Nikki Bella on the attack. She comes up big with a reversal. Nikki Bella with a nice reversal. If there's one place you don't want to get pummeled, it's your face. Now we have Nikki Bella on the attack. Oh man, she's rolling now. Oh no, a counter. Here comes Bree Bella. The final elimination, and this one is over. And there's the last one standing. What a match. You have to give credit where credit is due. That was one of the gutsiest performances I've seen in a very long time. You got that right, partner. Again, huge win here tonight. A bold move from the legendary Beulah just seen moments ago, and it's about damn time someone put Vicky Guerrero in her place. Speaking of which, Alicia Fox looks set to take revenge in our next match, the she team for the mystery partner to take on the Iconics. After weeks of being berated by the vicious pair, can Alicia Fox finally settle things once and for all? That match is up next. Billy Kay with that signature look of arrogance on her face as she makes her way to the ring. I wonder what it must be like to be so in love with yourself. Alicia Fox looks to be all business here tonight, guys. No surprise there, Michael. Alicia Fox is always ready to go.
and her partner from Los Angeles, California, Victoria. Guys, this match is sure to not disappoint, especially considering who's involved here tonight. You're absolutely right, Michael. This match will be one we'll be talking about for a long time to come. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. And guys, there is an undeniable big fight feel in the arena tonight. The collar and elbow tie up in a battle for control here. Tell me your thoughts on Alicia Fox. You're the expert. What does she need to do to win here? You know, I can't call this yet. What I can tell you is these competitors have that fire in their eyes tonight. This one is going to be great. I do expect her to show her opponent and the a quick finish. Can she do it? And she kicks out with relative ease. She powered out there, Michael. Alicia Fox with the offense. She's looking at it early. Plenty of fight left. She got her shoulder up, and we continue. She delivers a punishing DDT. Well-executed takedown. Billy Kay's on the attack now. Point precision on that elbow drop. Right into the center of the chest. Oh, her back has got to be in so much pain right now. A quick finish. Can she do it? She's absorbing some offense here. She's looking at it early. And there's the kick out. Might have slipped there, Cole. Billy Kay's on the attack now. Turning the tables. They ain't turned yet. Still got some work to do. That's a great example of teamwork right there. And there's the Russian leg sweep. No chance of staying up right after that one. She goes up high with a roundhouse. Absolutely happy. Look out. There's the tag. And that changes the entire outlook for these women, Michael. And she's got the fingers locked. This might be it. No, she breaks it. Wow, she's quite the escape artist, Michael. And now she's on the offensive. Look out! Oh man, she's rolling now.
She's on the defensive now. Her and her partner make it a great tag team. We'll see what they're made of here. And you just get that feeling that being outside the ring so much here in this match will eventually come back to haunt her. Well, she's looked good up until now. She just has to make sure not to absorb too much punishment here if she wants to get back into this thing. She better stay right where she is. Neckbreaker! This might be it, guys. Hey, what goes up must come down. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. And she hits the drop kick. Oh, and it's a reversal. Going all the way up. Look at this. Gonna try for something else here. I'm not sure what the plan is here, Michael. Corey, she's not getting up. Well, she better if she wants to win this match. With the tag is Alicia Fox. Well executed double team. Break this one up. Great ring awareness there, Michael. Fighting to get back to her feet here. She's just taking too long, Cole. She's got to move faster. She's getting absolutely assaulted now. Her tag team partner has to be concerned at this point. His partner must feel a Peyton just took her out with a leg lariat. Warm up the bus. This one is over. Big reversal for her there. There it is, Foxy putting those long legs to good use. She's back in full control now. We've seen some great tag team action over Whoa. here. And shoulders down, this could be it. What an incredible tag team contest. by these two here tonight. If you're not feeling good about yourself after a win like that, you better get yourself checked. Matches like that are the reason why I love this job so much. Our ECW Live special has been a night full of surprises, featuring the turn of a whole host of ECW legends, including Jazz, Lita, Victoria, Dawn Marie, and many more. New champions have been crowned, and all friendship could truly reach their breaking points. However, we move our focus to our main event of the evening as the next matchup looks set to implode as Nia Jax and Karma finally collide in a steel cage match. Who will walk out victorious after weeks of back and forth action? Our main event of the evening starts now. It's now time for the steel cage match we've all been waiting for. And judging from the sound of this crowd, the expectation level is high for this one. But I assure you, this match will not disappoint. 
Well, when it comes to the women's division, it doesn't get much more exciting than what we have coming up here. Boy, that's the truth. In fact, you can almost feel the anticipation level swell inside the arena as we get closer to the opening bell. Here we go, guys. We're now set for what promises to be an amazing steel cage match. And let's not forget the hazards these superstars are about to embark on. Give them credit. They'll clearly do anything to prove their dominance. Corey, is it me, or does she seem even more focused than usual here? It's not you, Cole. She's definitely looking a bit more focused, which is good, because she's going to need to be if she wants to win this one. Here we go, steel cage action, kicking off here. And there are few things more unforgiving than the cold steel of a cage match. And it sounds like the sold out arena is about to come unglued for this one. Hey, can you believe that impact? Let's take a moment to talk about Cobb. How about it? How is she going to win this tough matchup? She's certainly a force, Cole, but you have to remember who she's in the ring with there, too. Neither of these girls are pushovers, that's for sure. Here's Nia Jax with some offense of her own. Jacks. Cobb starting to slip some, but this certainly isn't something she can't come back from. If you're worried about her now, you haven't seen many of her matches. She can withstand so much more punishment than this. Well, there's still plenty of match to go here, guys. Unless something crazy happens, I don't envision this being the end of the road for her. She comes up short. If you're going to leave your feet, you got to make sure you're going to land the move. Eludes that one. Nope. Reverses it. This could be big. Whoa. Missed by a large margin there. Come on. How do you miss by that much? The small back took the brunt of that one. on fire look at this Nia Jax is letting everyone know exactly how she feels no reverses it got it cinched in the STF is cinched in Cobb starting to slip some but this one appears far from over and she knows that you know she's the kind of competitor that actually likes getting hit it motivates her and this might just be what she needs to put her... No! She breaks it! Wow, she's quite the escape artist, Michael. Yeah. Nia Jax able to avoid damage there.
Reverses that one. Hits her with a clothesline from seemingly out of nowhere. She's making her ascension up the cage wall. Away we go. And now it's Cobb. Look out. She'd been flung right off the cage. The strategy was solid. The execution, not so much. She lands an enormous elbow. On the shoulders here. And it could be a long way down from there. We're looking at complete domination here. That might have hurt her ego more than anything else. Nicely done. Oh man, Nia Jax goes down hard. She slams her down with great force. Man, Cobb is in pretty bad shape. I'm not so sure she even knows where she is at this point. Looking for the win. She comes up with a slam. Now, she just needs to finish her off. Look at her go. She shows signs of life. She's showing a lot more than that. Oh, and it's a reversal. Well, I guess that'll teach her a lesson. Byron, can she even get back to her feet? More importantly, does she even know where she is right now? That just changed the entire mood in this building. There she goes, right up the side of the cage. Heading up. And now she's making her way up the side of the cage. On the move here. Unbelievable. This singles match is over. Here is your winner, Awesome Call. What a back and forth battle that was. That's exactly why she's seen as one of the most dominant females on the roster. You got that right, partner. Again, huge win here tonight.